nursing student and I am a senior. I'm Grant. I'm a nursing student. I'm graduating in 2017. We got our um, acceptance letter at the same day. And then we kind of just I'm like, oh, you gonna mount? Oh, I'm gonna mount too, I guess. I think it's easier for us to get known because since we're guys, we're a small percentage of us. I mean, twins were like even smaller and we're like the only male twins at the school. So, in the first year, the very first year, I think we had all of our oh. classes, same exact schedule, same time, same teacher. So, this whole first year we were together. Sophomore year, we had, I think, majority, majority of our classes yeah. together because the, uh, they put it. My last name. Fail last name. So my last names were the same. <laughs> yeah. And then and junior then year kind of changed after that changed. because the schedules for nursing were different. So they kind of split us apart. Yeah, it's been a while. We like to hang out with our okay, friends. Sure. Oh. Basketball. We go to the gym um, during the winter season. We go snowboarding. We skis. And then in the summer, we like to go wakeboarding with our family, so I'm pretty, we're pretty excited to go do that this summer. What type of nurse uh, do both of you want to be? Do you guys want to be different nurses, or do you guys want to work around the same? I think we're totally different. Uh, yeah, we're totally different. I, I'm more like the ED, wound care, slash, like, what else? Like, the business aspect of it. And then for me, I'm more like the intensive care unit, med surge, telemetry, all the critical care units. I think like uh, we've always been very competitive, um, even you know throughout college we're still competitive with grades, with basketball, you know, lifting, all the good stuff. So that you know has definitely made us a lot closer, so that we can both support each other and help each other out with whatever we need. But I definitely agree that um, our relationship has gotten better throughout the years, and we're definitely here to definitely help each other, rather than you know try to like beat each other up about like you know grades and. Um, fighting about stuff, but we're we're here. I've noticed to like help each other more. Who has been your biggest inspiration in your life? I think my mom. I don't know about you. I say my dad. Yeah. Opposite. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Why your mom? I'd say my mom because she is a nurse, and she knows. She, I've worked with a lot of her coworkers, so they, she's um. They say she's a good nurse, and for me, since I'm a nursing major, I know I'm become a good nurse. So um, I try to learn as much as I can from her. She tried to give me a lot of tips, so for me to have my mom as my um, my person I look up to, definitely was appropriate. Why your dad? Um, for my dad, uh, I think he's really taught me so much over the years from how to act, how to, uh, how to treat people, how to do your homework, how to do household chores, um, and because I he didn't really grow up from the best type of family, and to see how his growth from then until now, it's. I think it really amazes me, and it makes me just want to be that type of guy for my future, too. If you can give male nursing students who are applying here to the mound, or the current male students right now, one piece of advice, what would you guys tell them? Let's we'll start with you, Grant. Um, I'll tell them just to, if you like it, come and enjoy it. This is a place, great place to learn. It's a good environment. You'll definitely learn a lot, but also be challenged at the same time. Uh, I would say just don't give up. It's from here on out, colleges, you can you can fail class and whatnot, and it's easy to get down on yourself and just see the no light at the end of the tunnel. But if you stay persistent, you'll get through it. We've all been through it. And it's just the way of college, and you just gotta keep adjusting. 